okay guys welcome to my youtube channel today i'm taking you through how to install suyu emulator or i'll be teaching you guys how to get or how to install the suyu emulator on your pc now bear in mind that the suyu emulator now is not released to the public yet so the installation that you are going to do it will be on the dev build meaning development build option version version rather sorry so before you continue make sure you have your suyu emulator and then a firmware with version 17.0 point one and your key now without without these two without these two you can't have suyu running on your pc so probably you have to get these two you can search on the internet for switch firmware and keys product keys and title keys yes simple search keys so let's get into the installation process now first of all you have to get your CU emulator so this is my CU emulator and we are going to extract it okay so okay so after the extraction just open your CU emulator now listen to what it will tell me i mean the pop-up you see as you opened the emulator it's telling me encryption keys are missing so please follow blah 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 to get all your keys firmware and games so meaning without the keys and firmware we can't use the suyu emulator but don't worry we have we have them over here we have the firmware and the keys so the first step is to install the keys now to install the keys copy the keys if it is in the zip format just copy it copy it like this just press on this copy copy it and then open the suyu emulator again ignore the warning come to i mean come to this place saying the file just press on the file and then press on open suyu folder now at this stage press on the keys the keys the keys folder just open the keys folder and paste in the keys zip i mean what we copied from our parents folder now extract these keys extract these keys extract it here so after the extraction you get these two files the product keys and the title keys now we are ready to go so what we will do is we quit or we close the emulator and reopen it again You see at this stage it didn't ask us for a product key then blah 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 because we have installed the product keys now the next step is or the next step you are going to install the firmware so to install the firmware i'll suggest the easiest way and the easiest 
way is press on these two over here this option over here and then as you can see you can see something like install firmware now let's go back to our parent folder i mean the folder that contain our our um, keys and firmware so, so let's go back to that folder now let's extract this firmware because this firmware is in the zip format now when you when you download the firmware it will be in the zip format so probably you have to extract it before you can use the firmware so at this stage you are going to extract this firmware right click on it and then select this option over here extract to firmware 17.01 point blah 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 select this option over here just select this option over here and wait for the extraction to be done now we are done extracting the firmware so these are the firmware these little files over here is the firmware so what we are going to do is let's go back to the suyu emulator then press on the tools this 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 option over here and then select the option that says install firmware so at this at this stage you can see um, a window like this this means that you have to select the folder that contains the firmware and when you look at my folder the f it's 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 located on the desktop so probably let's locate that folder so let's go back to the desktop select the suyu and then select the folder that contains the firmware press on select folder wait for it to be installed okay now we are done installing the firmware what we will do is we will reboot the emulator so um, let's exit it and reopen the emulator again You see it didn't even ask us for product key blah 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 because we've done all the necessary requirements so the next is we are going to um, it says double click to add a new folder to the game list so what we are going to do is we are going to select the folder that contains our game files so double click it my game files are located in this folder so i'll press on select folder boom as you can see it has been updated now if you want you can tick this option all right now we have a working suyu emulator please bear in mind this emulator is not released yet to the public and before you can have it you have to build it yourself now let's explore let's explore the uh, features of this emulator and one of the best features i like about this emulator is suyu has added the option to boot the original nintendo switch os directly i'm going to show you how it is press on the two over here and then press on the open home menu this will boot the original switch home os 
desert. You see? So this is how it looks like. Now let's configure our controller controller setting. So to do that, we have to go to the configuration setting. Then you select controller. The controller set, um, settings is easy. So I have this as my controller. So boom. As you can see, my controller is working. Okay. Wow. Let's close the game. Okay, and one of the <laughs> and another features that I liked about this new emulator is CU has added a new option to add cheat patches, remove patch, blah 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 blah, and it's it's awesome. Patch name. so thank you for watching my video and please do subscribe to my channel this is all i have for you